Hey everybody, welcome back to Slump Buster Reacts. And as you all know, the Buccaneers won the Super Bowl last Sunday. And it was a pretty boring Super Bowl. Like, even Brady looked bored playing it. I mean, he already knew he got the victory and he was just like, eh. It looked pretty easy for him. <laughs> but of course, Gridiron Heights still keeps going. I'm pretty sure they're going to come out with more episodes after the Super Bowl they did last season. And let's see what they have to say with this episode. Hope y'all enjoy it. We did it! This city means the world to me! Tampa forever! All right, only 30 more teams to go. Gronk, we're out. But Gronk just bought a house. <laughs> just buy another <laughs> Look. All right, Tom Brady, if you ever watch this video, uh, if you really want to prove that you're the GOAT, go to the Cowboys. Play, play for us for a season. If you get us that Super Bowl with everything that we have, yeah, you're the GOAT. And then, especially since you have to deal with Jerry Jones. <laughs> Look at this guy, a Super Bowl winning quarterback. Me, I lost a Super Bowl, and two years later, they shipped me off to Detroit with this guy. <laughs> Whoa, welcome to Lion King! Have dinner or become dinner! They traded Stafford to LA. Oh God, the sun! For me? <laughs> I mean, Stafford is pretty pasty. I have to give him that. A third and two firsts. Oh, got a tip! Here's a 2024 first round pick. Suddenly, <laughs> the price for a QB increased even more, which gave one man an idea. Taysom, we're gonna drive up the price of quarterback stock. <laughs> Hello, media. Can I interest you in Taysom Hill? He's Mormon. Oh, okay, I get, I get what Gridiron Heights is making fun of. They're making fun of the great movie called The Wolf of Wall Street with Leonardo DiCaprio. But also old. Well, gosh, I don't know. Taysom could punt and return the same kick. Well, all right, Taysom to the moon, baby. Lock me in. I got you, no cap. <laughs> Confusing? Here's Adam left going to bed, tub to explain. The Saints are $100 million over the salary cap already, and this year the cap is actually going to get lower for the first time in a decade. So the Saints need to increase Taysom's trade value. You guys are going to make me look good, right? So Taysom is now <laughs> worth $40 million a year. Hmm. So is the exit interview over? They are making more money than me. We need to impose restrictions. Maybe Taysom is good? No. <laughs> Everything is about money. <laughs> Great season, Team State Farm. <laughs> yeah, hope for State Farm. So I think that's also a, uh, a big short reference as well. Farm. So with Taysom rising, the price on more experienced QBs went through the roof. Dang it, Dak. I got some my jumbo trying to buy you. This is why you should have extended me earlier, Gerald. Used car. <laughs> Selling a lightly used car, man. I mean, this baby's still driving. Used car, man. Look, the internet says now I'm worth half a Donald coin. Taysom, watch me dance. Uh, coach, you should... I'm worth half a Donald coin. <laughs> Trade. Hold the line. Sorry, Deshaun. If Taysom Hill is now worth 10 first, no one on planet Earth can afford you. I appreciate your time. And just like that, the QB market crashed overnight, which <laughs> produced pure chaos. No team is better than some team! <laughs> Protect me. Uh, uh, Hurts, uh, or wins, or wins, uh, um, uh, Hurts, or, uh, or wins. It's gonna be good to get back. Man, I hate this f***ing sport. I need to figure out a way to cover this up. Did somebody say cover up? Urban Meyer! Introducing young kids you don't have to pay. You know you need to pay us now? Whoa, what? <laughs> So I assume that they're making fun of also the NCAA um, or not the NCAA, but the school is paying the players now. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching this season. It's a real shame it has to end. You know what? I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving! The show goes on! <laughs> Clammy, no, the season actually is over. They can have a silence me as long as you all buy Delaware clam shirts in the Bleacher Report store! Send in Teamy. Sure should be about Teamy. Come on, you fucking piece of shit. <laughs> All right, guys, that was pretty good. And it's pretty fitting that Great Iron Heights made fun of the big short and the Wolf of Wall Street. I mean, a couple of weeks ago, the whole GameStop thing happened where they were. They pretty much played Wall Street at their own game. <laughs> Alright everybody, I hope you enjoyed the video and of course if you like our content, please like and subscribe. Uh, please leave a comment, please interact with us. If you want to know more about our sponsors, look in the ticker below and listen to the Slump Buster wherever you get your podcasts. Alright everybody, stay safe and have a good one.